What is the difference between people with healthy vision and people with eye problems? With my experience of training people with different eye problems all over the world for more than 10 years, I can say that the main difference in the visual behavior. What is the visual behavior and how is it different? Visual behavior is the set of habits. For example, people with eye problems, they, for some reasons, they got a habit to narrow their eyes and to squint their eyes. They, uh, at some point, they realize that they can see better if they contract their eye muscles and they narrow their eyes and they will, they will be able to see something. And they, they don't, without realizing that this is one of the main causes of eye problems. There are also some life circumstances that could cause uh, creating such habits and forming such habits. Well, for example, uh, the lifestyle, the, the, uh, the job, the occupation. For example, uh, some uh, professions can be very stressful and stress is also one of the, uh, the causes of eye problems and it also uh, causes uh, unhealthy vision behavior, narrowing the eyes and, the, and uh, avoiding the light and uh, a lot of stress. For example, uh, trading. Yeah? Trading is a very stressful work and many young people, they are very ha happy to do the trading. trading. People who work in sales, the sales work could be also very stressful because they have deadlines, they have to communicate with people, they have some uh, sales plans or something like this. Uh, there are some jobs having to do with uh, visual work, especially uh, in, labor in laboratories, for example, yes, then when they have to, to, to tense their eyes uh, very much. And many people now work in front of PCs, in front of uh, computers. And some people with healthy vision, they realize that yeah, they need a rest, they have uh, some breaks, they go to the gym, so they compensate uh, their visual work in the office. But some people, they do not realize it and they just keep working and they can sit on in front of the computer for many hours and then they wonder why they have eye problems as uh, farsightness or myopia or presbyopia. So uh, the main reason and the main difference between people with uh, eye problems and people with healthy vision is their lifestyle, their attitude to the stress and stress tolerance as well. Uh, many people uh, are very easy, you know, when they have some stressful situation, they, they remain calm, they remain balanced, they remain um, positive. But the other people, they are very pessimistic and they, they are very emotional and they um, are worried all the time without realizing that all these worries, all these doubts in their mind, all their, uh, they cause tension in their, in their mind, in their psychic, and this tension is being broadcast via the eye muscles, via the ciliary muscles, and of course it causes eye problems. The other thing is, um, if we compare the people uh, with, um, uh, eye problems such as glaucoma or cataract or uh, retina detachment. So the, the, the problems having to do with the blood circulation. What is the difference and why it's happening? It's happening with people who do not care about their blood circulation. They keep sitting on the computer and 
the blood is getting very lazy for them. If we are talking about the blood, what features of the blood are the most uh, important? The first one is how fast it's circulating around the body. Yeah? If it stops somewhere, if it's stuck somewhere, uh, there is a blockage. Yeah? And uh, it's not good, especially if you're not... Uh, um, if you're not moving enough movement enough movement means a life yeah so if you keep moving you will be healthy if you stop or if you slow down uh, the blood circulation will slow down the metabolism will slow down and you will start accumulating more toxins the second feature of the blood is the quality of the blood the quality of the blood means that your blood should be free from toxins. And the toxins, uh, they, are, they are getting into the blood when we eat unbalanced food. Yeah? When, we, uh, when we are getting very stressful. Yeah? Because our emotions, bad emotions, they also cause uh, toxins in the blood. Do you realize it? Yes, it physically happens when you are stressful, when you are yelling at somebody or when you are very upset. Uh, your hormones, uh, bad hormones, they are getting into your blood and the, the blood quality is getting worse. So forget about bad emotions and be more stress tolerant to be healthy. And to have a healthy vision so you should train your stress tolerance you should forget about uh, negative uh, emotions negative things of course our life is different and sometimes we experience not only uh, the good situation we can also experience bad, bad situation but the difference between people with healthy vision and the difference between uh, and uh, people with uh, bad vision with uh, high problems is that the, the healthy people they uh, go back to the norm much quicker yeah so if you experience some bad things please go back to the norm very soon as soon as possible and you will be much healthier you or you will be much more uh, enthusiastic about life so, but if you already have eye problems, don't be upset because uh, you can train your vision and you can do a lot of things to help uh, your vision to become better. So it's not too late and you, you are very welcome to join our Vision Academy classes online or workshops or to join the, uh, the trip. It's also very... Um, fun and very uh, effective way to work on your vision but the first thing i think you you can start just the online classes the session or the group classes whatever format of work you prefer and we will be happy to see you with us so if you like this video please uh, click on the like leave your comments if you have your experience if you have your uh, ideas how it should be um, uh, subscribe to our channel and uh, click on the bell not to miss the next video cheers